let's do the three main categories that men will complain about. Uh, mm -hmm. Is that she complains too much, she nags, and she controls. And most women are aware that they complain too much, okay? And most women are aware of nagging. Oh, you said you're gonna do that, you didn't do it. When are you gonna do that? You stay on the case. And when he has some resistance to something. And so, but most women are not aware of how they control. And, and sometimes men can't even articulate how you control, but they feel controlled. And they'll say that, I feel controlled. And uh, so, you have to kind of understand male psychology, understand why we were, we feel control when you don't even know you're controlling and it's certainly not your intention to control. But a man's primary motivation in a relationship, if you're being selfish, I wanna feel happy, but the way I feel happiest is when you're happy. Okay, that's the reality. If a woman is happy, he's happier, period. If I take her to the movies, I wanna go see the movie, yeah but I'm taking her to the movies and if she really likes it, then I feel like I wrote that movie. I feel like I directed that movie. I feel happier than I could feel on my own if I can provide something for you. And you just don't have that experience, women. You know, <laughs> I could have a really burnout trip going some around the world teaching classes and plain, you know, things don't work out well with the flights and maybe the audience or whatever. Some bad things happen. I'm all stressed out, feeling kind of down. If I come home, my wife is happy, all that washes away. But if I go out and have a great time, having happy, 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 and my wife's having a hard time, oh, you know, the toilets overflow, you weren't here, the kids got sick, I couldn't get in touch with you. You know, she could go up, big long list of frustrations. And I come home and she's feeling that way. And I said, oh, I just met so-and-so, this movie star. I stayed at the best hotel, it was fantastic. I got standing ovations and she can see I'm on top of the world she's gonna be gonna be even more upset, more upset. Yeah, you have all the fun, you have the good stuff. You're not designed to find your happiness through a man's happiness. You're designed to find your happiness through the support a man can give you in relationships. You're also designed to find happiness on your own, with your children, with nature, with God, with education, you know, with service, making money. All these things are designed, but when it comes to a man, your primary source of happiness from him is what he can do for you, period. It's not what you can do for him. Don't get lost into that. That's your mothering energy. And you know, sometimes people will complain, oh, you're saying women, we should do this, we should do that. Why should we do all this stuff? To get what you want. Just like if you go to a job, what do you do? I'm just giving you the instruction manual of how do you get what you want from a guy, which will make him successful in making you happy. This is all about what can we, what can you do as women to get what you want? Not to give him what he wants, although that's part of how you get what you want. Because if you, for example, appreciate a guy for the things he does, he's gonna do more. And if you do these annoying, irritating things, he's gonna do less.